I'm most definitely not running on no sleep and there definitely isn't a strawberry stain on my shirt. Hi people, it's Ellie here. So I am back at college. That means new teachers, new classes, yada yada yada. For my English class, my professor gave us this questionnaire to answer. She just explained that she wanted to know a little bit more about us and how we think. I didn't think anything of it, so I just took it home and I wanted to do it that night. So when I actually got around to doing this questionnaire, it sent me into this huge existential crisis. It was the pros questionnaire. If you don't know what the pros questionnaire is, it's pretty much this personality questionnaire um, where it asks you really deep questions and you really have to think about it. And you might be asking yourself how this questionnaire could give me an existential crisis because questionnaires are supposed to be easy and light. Not this one. For example, the first question on the questionnaire was, what is your idea of perfect happiness? Um, as the questionnaire goes along, you just keep getting deeper and deeper. Like, what's your greatest fear? What's your current state of mind? Um, when and where are you happiest? How would you like to die? It's just this list of 35 really insane questions that I wasn't expecting to have to answer. These are the kind of questions that you don't think about. So when I was just laying on my bed, just getting ready to answer this quick questionnaire, I wasn't ready. I felt like if I knew what this questionnaire was ahead of time, I would have prepared myself. But I just went head first and I was so deep. I don't even know why I found this questionnaire so hard. It really made me think about my life and the importance I had to it and what made me happy and what I was scared of and the little parts of me that I didn't want to share. You have to be really honest with yourself to answer this questionnaire and I found that so hard to do. I mean, yeah, I'm a pretty honest person as it is, but being honest to yourself. <sighs> the questionnaire ended up taking me a little over an hour to actually complete and it is only 35 questions. Maybe it was just the overwhelmingness of the day because it was my first day back at class that I got this questionnaire. It made me think about my happiness and where I am in my life right now. I don't know the whole psychology aspect of this questionnaire but I can definitely see that there is one and I'd be interested to see how I ranked if ranking is the correct word. I want to see how my answer is compared to everyone else. Maybe I'm the only one that took this questionnaire seriously. I have no idea. If you're interested more about this questionnaire and the exact questions I did, because I know there are a couple different versions of the questionnaire, um, I made a Tumblr post, link in the description box. I answered all of the questions honestly the way I answered them for the paper. Like I encourage everyone to do this questionnaire. It really makes you think about yourself. So just go to the link in the description box and do it and post what you put, and I'm looking forward to seeing all those. But that's it. Uh, if you like this video, please make sure to give it a like if you like, and subscribe, and that's it. So I'm gonna go. Bye. Thanks for watching. Imagine Workshop is awesome. Would you like to subscribe? You've got mail. See you next time. Fun fact, I'm holding V8 throughout this whole video, but I haven't taken a sip of it yet because I realized I had lipstick on.